All right, Louisa Chirico, terrific three-hour, three-set win today over world number 27, Alizé Cornet. How did you do it out there? Uh, thank you. Um, you know, I needed to, to stay solid today, and I played pretty well, and I'm happy with uh, how I executed out there. So, you know, looking forward to the next match. So she had the six uh, double faults before you even double faulted. Do you think maybe she was nervous out there instead of the youngster? <laughs> Um, maybe, you know, de uh, definitely nerves played a big part of today, especially being such a close match throughout the whole match. So, um, you know, but I tried to just focus on my, my side of the court and myself and, and keeping my serve solid and making a lot of first serves. And yeah. Now, I last saw you in Charlottesville just three months ago at the ITF. Um, so much has changed since then for, for you, has it not? Yeah, I've had a lot of first experiences and a lot of new experiences since then. Um, so... Yeah, I'm, I'm really looking forward to being, to, I mean, this was my first win this week here at a WTA event, so I'm um, happy about that and looking forward to the next match, like I said. So are you done with ITF? No, no, I don't, definitely not. I, I think it's important to kind of keep my schedule mixed, and that's, you know, how I got here, and so um, I wouldn't say I'm done with ITFs, but, you know, we'll see how my ranking goes after this. Now, in Charlottesville, you traveled with a very light contention compared to D.C., isn't that right? Well, yeah. Yeah, I just had my coach there, and um, today, well, this is pretty close to home. Uh, it's a quick train ride or quick flight. Uh, my pa my mom actually drove here, so um, it's not too far. So I have my parents and my grandparents that are staying with us from overseas. So Now, I saw your dad in the stands. He said he had recorded the whole thing back home on Tennis Channel. Do you think he's going to be watching that a couple of times? Probably, yeah. He was very excited. He gets very uh, nervous and fidgety a little bit, but no, he's, he's, it's great. <laughs> so I, I assume he's going to need an intermission with a three-hour match. Yeah, probably. I think uh, tomorrow. I don't. I don't think I play tomorrow, so I'll have a day off, and he'll have a day off in my. <laughs> no, but I'm just kidding. No, they they love. I think they love watching and coming out. And it's exciting. It's exciting for me, and it's fun to have them here. Luisa Chirico, very exciting uh, to watch you play, and we look forward to watching you play the rest of the week. Thanks again. Yeah, thank you.